extra panic on her face because she's on. Um, I'm coming out of Romans 5, verse 5, yeah. Um, my topic is don't get your hopes up because you might just cry. And um, I'm getting by Oh, you're supposed to have your sword at all times. Can I borrow a Bible? Oh, you're fired. <laughs> you flunk. I was playing. <laughs> okay. Does everybody have it? Yeah. All right. Now hope does not disappoint because the love of God has been pour- poured out into our hearts by the Holy Spirit. Who, get, who was given to us. To me, that's saying, don't be, don't be ashamed in what you believe in, because in Jesus mm-hmm. shed his love to everybody, for, for everybody, for us, and received the Holy Ghost. Don't make it like, don't try to take the Holy Ghost or grab the Holy Ghost. You have to receive it when you give him your praise and all that stuff. Let everybody know your religion, what you believe in, and don't be afraid to share the gospel. Amen. That's right. That's right. Because he died on the cross for me and you and everybody else in the whole building and everybody. Amen. Um, Including me. Don't make up the gospel. Like, don't act like you are the Holy Spirit because that will be uh, like a sin. And you can go to hell for that, I think. That would be like a big (laughs) mark on your list. Stand for God, and He'll stand for you. And Amen. God is a forgiving God, so whatever you do, if you ask Him to forgive you and mean it, He will forgive you. And and if you could, you you can't control the Holy Spirit, because if you control it, He won't be able to move. Amen. And that's all I got. Amen. <laughs> Tag Mr. Brown. <laughs> Tag Mr. Brown. Nah. Tag your ring.